Hello everybody, welcome back to You Got 5 Minutes. Um, this time it's a game called The Nightmare Cooperative. I've never played this game before, so I don't know what I'm meant to be doing. Um, I'm pretty sure it's a, like I think it's a, a keyboard game though, because like from what I've seen on the, like I really wish there was a controller support, that'd be really good. In fact, let me have a wee look, let me have a wee look, see if there's any controller support. Clear local data. Type yes to him. Okay. Okay, so there's a tutorial. Um, in fact, I had a tiny wee shot of the tutorial, but like, I never really got that far. So, uh, the game's essentially like up, down, left, right on the controller, uh, on, the, on, the, on the keyboard and spacebar for like using special attacks. So, let's have a wee shot. I like the art style. I like the, the simple sort of, it's got a, a thing we going on here with the, it's got like a sort of guacamole style thing going on here. You know what? Yeah, that guy's just got mauled, Darth mauled. It's like, it's turn based, so, like, you move and then they move, but if you bump into an enemy that attacks them, uh, but you get attacked as well. So the whole point, oh my goodness, he just got killed, he got totally wasted that guy. Ah, I just got killed. Okay, uh, let's try that again. I don't have any clue. Uh, replay. So it's uh, procedurally generated as well, obviously. There's uh Oh my goodness, no. Uh, I'm gonna miss that chest down the bottom. It looks like the the chest with the numbers in it spawn that amount of enemies, maybe? I see, I think. Aha! Uh -huh. Here you go. Ha! Okay. So it's a very simple game, like the whole up, down, left, right thing. You know, you kinda... I don't know. Oh my goodness, my mage guy is going to get total killed. Oh yeah, he's dead. It's like simple game but very difficult in its execution. Oh my goodness, really? Oh no, poison. Yeah, you like it's really puzzly and like you've got to. Oh my goodness, this guy's going to die. Eh? I got a pendant, whatever that does. Ah, I got killed again. I didn't know. I didn't know. I'm sorry. I got to three levels. So try, try one more. One more. Um. Okay. So I'm gonna take the risk and like try and open one of these chests. I like these potions though. Right. Getting a wee bit more and more complex with each. Uh, I like that. Not like at all. Uh, huh. Let 
and just try to get like all of these guys in a, in a row here. Strange. It's kind of like it's weirdly soothing as well, though. Like, uh, one of these guys is going to take damage, so I will. Oh man, I want those boots. Give me those boots. Oh no, there's enemies. Oh, that guy does knock back. Yes, that guy's a legend. main guy's got a buster sword as well. Love that. Hey, uh, Man. This is... Yeah, this is totally difficult. <laughs> I'm trying to, like, figure it out. So, like, enemies will spawn eventually anyway. Oh, no, the guy got killed. Yeah, I'm going to just jump to the next floor. It's very simple. I think this is... Ah, yes. Oh, no. Oh, man. This little ninja guy is going to, like get killed. Diag oh, there's diagonal ones as well now. Oh no, they're all dead! Ah, oh, I should have went up around the back. I forgot. Right, anyway, that's uh, the Nightmare Cooperative, guys. It's an interesting game. Uh, it's very simple to play. I think it's quite a light game as well. Like, it doesn't... I don't think it has, like, quite a... It's not, like, a very big install or anything like that as well. Uh, yeah, and it obviously looks like there's 16 floors there. I don't know if it goes any further than that, but yeah, that's, like, it's a weird, interesting, it's different, you know, it's definitely a different game. Uh, but if it interested you, I'll, oh, vaguely clever patrol guard, your party killed by a vaguely clever patrol guard. Uh, yeah, but if it interested you, I'll put a link in the description. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time. Bye!